of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. The Australian is 29. The Brazilian is 34. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. All right, to get us started now, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed USC Heavyweight Championship of the World. It's first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai fighter, holding a professional record of 35 wins, 12 losses, one draw, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, presenting the challenger, the ex-murderer, Wanderlei Silva! And now you see the champion fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 25 wins, 6 losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Sydney, Australia, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Robert Whitaker. All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, and a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. All right, so here we go as round one gets underway. Two world-class level strikers here, and the expectation is we're gonna get a kickboxing match here in the octagon. Yes, we are going to get a striking match. One guy is very good at kicks. The other guy has unbelievable hands. Let's see what type of attack is going to win the battle for this great stand-up fighter. A swing and a miss by Silva. Man, how about the steam behind that Whitaker jab time? Robert Whitaker is a great striker. I mean, he has it all when it comes to stand up in the boxing. And that is on full display right now. Oh, you heard about his jab. He's back in the twist position. This is where he has done a good So inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Right now, it looks like he may be trying to set up an arm triangle choke. He needs to secure the left arm, push it across, and secure it with his head. Watch triangle, watch triangle. Posturing up now. Now he's okay. Now he can escape. All right, closed guard now. You gotta be careful though. He's got a lot of submissions off his back. Back to the feet now. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Just misses with the straight left hand. Switching stances here. Another head kick lands. Got to start raising that guard, or this is going to be the end. You got to start raising the guard and guiding that head kick down back to four. That is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. So just over 20. Point accuracy on that punch right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to win. Closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. 
Silva's lower jaw now starting to show oh! signs of swelling. And just like that, the fight is over. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight. But don't ignore all the work he did with his hands. And give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eagle Beings called a stop in this contest at two minutes, 37 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still. So the celebration is on, and it figures to continue deep into the night for the UFC heavyweight champion and still after the knockout victory here tonight. And given all this man has...